Devereaux is just an amazing place for individuals and families that need help in terms of their behavioral health, their emotional health. We have therapeutic foster care, an outpatient clinic for adolescents. We have about eight respite homes across the state, a residential treatment center in Scottsdale, Arizona, and we have an assessment and intervention center in Tucson. We have kids as young as two years old that we provide outpatient services for that might be diagnosed with autism. We have a lot of kids that we see are exhibiting some really challenging behaviors, physical aggression, a lot of mood dysregulation, depression, post-traumatic stress disorder, and then some children that are actually struggling with psychosis. In residential treatment, we absolutely see the most complex cases that you could possibly imagine. We have a 10-acre campus in North Scottsdale. That campus has evolved from day school and has really progressed over time to where now we provide residential care, food services, recreation. We have a full athletic field. We have a pool area. We have an art room. The dorms are separated with little kids, teenage girls, then you got teenage boys, and then you have a co-ed dorm. They are here able to have a safe, secure environment where all their needs are going to be met. Working with special ed has always been a passion of mine. The classroom does set up the kids for success just because of the comfort. It's warm, it's welcoming, they get the one-on-one -on -one attention. We have an amazing culinary arts program in our residential treatment center. All of our clients that are enrolled in that program obtain their food handler certificate. It is crucial for us to follow protocols and programs that are rooted in evidence that we know work. We have an assessment and intervention program. That is for kids who have been out of home for a little bit of time, basically due to a crisis, and we assess them to make sure that we're providing a plan that meets their needs, that they can go back into the community. Sometimes there's a few approaches that we can use, and then we can have that family be part of that decision. It doesn't do us any good to see the child as a unit in and of themselves. We have to include the family and engage the family. They're such an active part of the treatment process. Our services build upon each other. On this kind of more of a prevention side, we have our outpatient services, our respite services. In our respite program, we really are taking individuals who live with their family. They have a behavior health need, but those family members need a break. Devereaux has four community houses that the kids can go to on school breaks. They can also spend the weekends there. They have staff there 24-7. It's really fun. We do go on a lot of outings, places like where there's go-cars, golf, and like all these other games, laser tag. And then it just begins to progress forward into foster care services. We have what we call therapeutic foster care. They are professional families. We match children into their home and their family based on their family composition. In therapeutic foster care, oftentimes that family is the treatment. Usually by the time we get our kids, they've bounced around the system a lot and been in several homes. Therapeutic foster parents have to be a little more patient and be committed. We also provide residential treatment. That would be a longer stay in our residential facility where we're really providing intensive treatment, intensive therapy. We had some situations take place within our family that they're very traumatic. So his trust in adults is very minimal. Devro has literally not left our, our home or our family since day one. They showed that they actually cared. Instead of like passing judgment, they helped. His clinician that he had in Devereaux, TK, she was amazing. They were a good pair, they were a good match. I'm proud of myself because I got to control my behavior. Families can trust Devereaux to bring their child into care with us. We have people that really have huge hearts and are utilizing best practices in the therapy that we do. The Devereaux family standard is quite simple to explain. If my family member were coming to get services, how would I want that family to feel, to be treated from the moment they walk in the door to the moment they leave our care? Making sure that it meets my standard for what I would want for my family. If I had to do it all over again, I would. I would put Richard back at Devereaux. He felt loved. They're not just staff members, they're family. Every single human being on this planet can be anything that they want. Our role is to give them the tools and resources to open that up, opening up your potential, opening up a future for you in your life.